If you like food and who doesn't, you probably already know Nashville's food scene is fantastic. And now local restaurants and chefs are being recognized on the national stage. The James Beard Awards, often called the Oscars of the food world, released semifinalists this week. And as you can imagine, Nashville fared pretty well. News Channel 5's Araceli Crescencio spoke with some of the more unlikely nominees who couldn't believe what was happening. We had a product that people love. When you ask the founders of Slim and Huskies what their secret ingredient is, they don't shy away from telling the truth. We created what we feel like is Nashville style pizza from three Nashville uh, born and raised guys. And, um, you know, you, you really taste the southern roots and our pizza. Friends Clinton Gray, Derek Moore and Emmanuel Reed opened their business on Buchanan Street in 2017 and almost instantly struck a chord in North Nashville. So the first six months or so, or so we had a line, you know, pretty much down the block. And, um, you know, that first day we said, man, like we have to, you know, we have something on our hands. Now in 2023, they have locations in Atlanta, Sacramento and Memphis. Every expansion the trio makes is with intense attention. But this week, something happened none of them saw coming. She's like, you don't know? I'm like, nah, what is it? Like the James Beard Award, y'all got nominated. I feel like we got nominated for the Oscars or the Grammys. We cook every day because we love what we do. It was a similar taste of success down the street for chef Julio Hernandez, who needed some convincing to believe the news. When it really hit me was when I saw the Tennessee. I was like, that is us. I don't know why. My name and the company was not enough. I had to see Tennessee on it to really get it. His food truck, Maiz de la Vida, has made a name for itself for offering some of Nashville's best Mexican food. And after some thinking, Hernandez says being nominated in the category of emerging chef fits. We have emerged from my house where we started. We emerged from the farmer's market here in East Nashville where we went. We emerged from the sidewalk here in Chopper where we emerged from. Then we have a tortilla shop and then we're moving forward to open the uh, brick and mortar in the Gulch this summer. Moving forward, a panel of judges will determine five finalists. Final winners will be announced in June. But no matter who wins or loses, nominees say Nashville's food scene is already a winner. In Nashville, Araceli Crescencio, News Channel 5. Such a success, and I'm starving now too. <laughs> well, several other Nashvillians also received nominations. That includes Noel Marchetti at Yolan for Outstanding Pastry Chef, Josh Habinger at Bastion, and Trevor Moran at Locust, both nominated for Best Chef in the South. He's congrats to all.